Matt Goss' best friend Rob Ferguson has claimed his strictly come dancing scores have been inexplicable and nonsensical as he slams the program. The brother's legend, 54, is currently entertaining the nation with his turn on the BBC show, but found himself in the dreaded first dance off and then second bottom of the leaderboard. Craig Revel Horwood scored Matt a disgraceful three during Saturday night's show, while he bagged a six from Motsi Mobuse, a five from Shirley Ballas and a seven from Anton Dubeka. Rob, who has worked with Matt for over 30 years, told The Mirror, there is no consistency and no correlation between comments versus votes. In losing my faith in the legitimacy of BBC's Strictly Matt and his partner Nadia Beachkova danced the Viennese waltz to hold my hand from Top Gun. Anton recognized the hard work Matt has been putting in since last week as he thought it was a huge improvement but a bit loose in the frame. Rob continued, I cannot reconcile Craig's descending score for Matt from week 1, 5, 4, 3. There's no question he has improved. He described the scoring as inexplicable and nonsensical, adding, I can't help but think there is an agenda. Matt managed to dodgy the dance-off during Sunday night's show with Richie Anderson becoming the second celebrity to leave the BBC show. Head judge Shirley's feedback was, what we have to get from you is consistency. While Anton implied he could see improvement by saying, there is a ballroom boy struggling to get out. It comes after Matt revealed in his memoir, More Than You Know, a man tried to snatch me into a car. I can still see his face vividly, dark haired and with a mustache. He continued, I often used to sit on the wall by an old people's home. One day I was there, just hanging out and being a kid really, when I heard a noise behind me. I looked round and saw this man reaching for me. Over his shoulder I could see his car parked by the grass verge with the back door open. I jumped off the wall which was 10 feet off the pavement and ran all the way home. It scared the hell out of me, 